Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, Twisted Paper Studio, how are you? I hope you are all well. It's day 45, you guys, day 45 of the 100 Day Craft Project. I cannot believe it, day 45. Okay, let's read our dragon card. We, have, we don't have very many left, we have one, two, three, we only have four left, you guys. Okay, day 45. Oh, the lucky clover dragon, oh, how cute! Oh my goodness, he's got ladybugs all on him, a rainbow, and all these clovers. Wait, are there, th these are all three leaf clovers, but the one on him is a four leaf clover. How cute. Okay, oh, where's the book? Uh-huh, covered it. Uh-huh. Lucky Clover Dragon. I cannot believe that it's day 45, day 45, you guys, day 45. Ha, huh, ha. Huh. We're almost halfway there. Where is the L M? Get it right, Donna. L M. Lucky Clover Dragon. Okay. So it says, expect things to start going your way when the Lucky Clover Dragon shows up. From the frills around its muzzle to the four-leaf tail, this dazzling green stunner is here to shower you with good things. This may not be things you expected, but do pay attention to your. Pay attention to your surroundings. <laughs> Check those pockets and couch cushions to find missing items and money. Don't be surprised if you go to a restaurant and they offer you a free dessert just because. Hey now, that's a good thing. <laughs> the magic of this little beauty is to put things in your path. Your job is to look for them. You'll miss the rainbow if you don't look up. How cute. That's adorable. Lucky Clover Dragon, you guys. Lucky Clover. Okay. All right. Now let's move on to our beautiful blessings. Beautiful blessings. Um, two. Uh, let me go into my YouTube studio. Um, beautiful blessings to Liz Schmidt. Uh, Liz has a question. Wait. I think I missed when you made this cover. It says here. Oh. Did you miss it, Liz? Um, you're talking about this cover, Liz. This is in my 100 Day Craft Project file. If you go back and look, I do all, everything that we're doing here, anything that I put out on the table, we've done together in the 100 Day Craft Project. So you can go over and take a look. We started this cover and I worked on the pages um, just recently this week. Okay, so beautiful blessings to you, Liz. And beautiful blessings to Annette DePete. And beautiful blessings to Brenda Hall. Okay, beautiful blessings to you guys. Let's get this started here, shall we? Let's get, um, where's our timer? Come on, get with it, Donna. Start, all right, start the timer. Okay, so I had this, I, I don't know, I was inspired by this book and the pages in it, so I think I'm gonna use a few of them. I don't know how many we're gonna do, but we'll just try. We'll try, we'll try it. Isn't that cover beautiful? So gorgeous. I liked this too. Maybe hmm. the pages are linen paper. And these book this one's from the 1800s. I don't know when this one's from. 1839. Woohoo! And this one's from 1864, I think. 1860. So let's see. Um let me see if I can get this out so we can get it in one piece. Hmm. 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 I do this like cray cray. Don't mind me. I gotta, I gotta find the middle. Oh, I already did it. Okay. I did it before, once before. Usually I find the middle and then I take out the strings. Don't be sticking together. Okay. All right, let me move these over to the side. I figured we'd work with some papers today. I was inspired by looking at them on my shelf. I looked at them on my shelf and I said, ooh. Okay, and then I took out some stamps. Um, oh, yes, I jumped on the bag wagon, you guys. Um, band wagon, bag wagon, I don't know what, band, band wagon. And I got myself these Sample stamps. I think that's who they are. Sample. I think it's you, Sample. 
I think so. I don't know if she watches my channel, but I know she follows me on Instagram, so I'll have to do her proud. So these are so darling, so cute, by Creative Expressions. Dates from the past. I just think they're adorable. And we will just see. I don't know what I'm doing. Nope, I don't. <laughs> That's usually the case with me. Um, I like these papers though. I have some linen fabric here. And, hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. <laughs> I don't know. Let's do a bunny stamp. Let's let's stamp on some fabric. Let's use some blue. That's what I had on here before, blue. So we'll just go ahead and use some blue again. We'll try it. We'll give it a try. I don't want to get all blue all over me. So how are all of you? I hope you're all well. Today's not today is for me is getting closer to go see my babies. Um, so I'll be in uh, New Jersey soon. It's not really the day yet because because really for you guys it's Friday, but for me oh I love it oh, I love it. Um, for me it's Friday. Friday no, for me it's still only. Tuesday. <laughs> Let me see. I'm gonna clean this up. I cleaned it off a little bit. There we go. It doesn't come off very well. Okay, we'll use this one. I love these bunny stamps. These are from Make Makey. Makey. Mackey. Makey. M-A-K-I. M-A-K-I. They are on Etsy. They're from Germany, and they have cute bunnies. <laughs> okay. I ordered some more, so I'm waiting. Um, it is the year of the bunny, you guys, and uh, I plan on doing bunnies all year. Oh, gosh, how darling. And this was dried marigold. The other one was blue. Let's see what else. Let's do... Um, Let's do this one. This one's cute. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I don't. I'm just stamping. I'm just stamping on fabric, you guys. I love fabric. You all know that I work with the fabric in my paper. You guys know that. So, we're doing that today. <laughs> but we're stamping on it. I don't really even know what we're making. <sighs> Maybe I should decide that? <laughs> should <laughs> Should I decide it? Oh, look how cute. How darling. What else can we do? I have some, oh, maybe we should do some numbers. Some of these um, sample. That's why I took it out. Okay. What should we do? Hmm. Um. Hmm. What should we do? It's like, I like them all, but then when I went, when I go to use them, I don't know which one to pick. Oh, I see. These are, okay. So these are, so there are, this is not the way the stamp is. This is the way you can make it. Okay. So you don't have to, you, I just took out the number, not the circle, just the number. I need to clean this. Don't mind it. I'm so bad. Okay. So now wait. Um, this way, you gotta go backwards. Wait, do you know that? You guys know that, right? You gotta go backwards when you want, when you want to put something on here. This has like a grid line on it. Oh, it's very sticky. Okay. <laughs> it should be, should be sticky. Um, are there just plain numbers? Oh, here's plain number. Hmm. We'll use this one. Okay. Let's see. We'll put it here like that. 
All right, we'll, we'll test down our piece of paper first. See what happens on a piece of paper. And then, and then, where's my, here, um, where's my black? Hold on. Let me, let me see. I need a dark color. Or uh, maybe brown. I'm probably going to use brown, but let's just see what this looks like first. No, not that way. Okay, wait. I need to put this. Wait a minute. This way. Oh, beautiful. Oh, okay, but brown. Not black. Brown. Right? Yes. Okay, like you guys can answer me. <laughs> um, hmm. I gotta find it first. I have to find. I hope my brown is in here. Oh, I'll be so sad if it's not. I'll be really, really sad. No, it's probably not. I mean, why would it be? So I'm going to have to use, oh, look at that. All my glue, all, I mean, all my inks. Oh, here it is. Oh, boy. There we go. Okay, so this is vintage photo, yes. Okay, let's try, let's try this. Better. Yes. Yes. Okay. And then... So now we need um huh, I don't even know what I'm doing. I'm just having fun. <laughs> it's okay, we can do that sometimes, you know. We can just have fun. We don't have to have an angle for everything, do we? We're just having fun. Oh what did you look at that? Why I ripped it the wrong way. Okay, now I'm not having fun anymore. <laughs> It was supposed to go this way. And now I'm just not having fun anymore. That wasn't fun. That was not fun. This is very, very antique linen. Okay. It didn't want to rip the way that I ripped it. It ripped the opposite way. Let's do him again. Sugar. Okay, that was not fun. Ripped the bunny right in half. Right in half. All right, let me just take a look here because I'm not, now I'm gonna have to cut it out. There we go. Okay, cut straight. Oh, I should have used my fabric scissors. Okay, perfect. All right, so now we have a bunny, another bunny. Oh, and this bunny. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I'm not ripping that again. I learned my lesson. I need to rip it without any images on it. <laughs> we don't know. We don't know what will happen. Okay, taking this bunny off. And there's the number. Hmm. Okay, where do we want this number? Maybe I should test it on here. Let me test it on this one that ruined. Let me test it out and just see. Make sure it's gonna work. Okay, yeah, it will work. All right, so let's do this down at the corner. Down here. All right, that's number 1904. <laughs> and now let's get another number. Um, that's bunny number 1904. 
Oh, I don't know where this went. Okay, here. That way. I never can do this right. Ever. Never, ever, ever. All right. This one is going to be this long number. And let's do it this way. Oops. Okay. We'll do it this way. Hmm. Oh, I hope. Oh, here we'll do it along this side. Come on now. I hope you inked up good. Should we test it first? Yes. You never know if I'll put these numbers backwards or something. That'd be something I'd do. Okay. I'm going to put this down right there. Look how cute. Okay. And then now this one. Um, we'll do a different number on this one. I better decide on what we're doing. <laughs> I'm just playing. Um, this number. These are cute, you guys. Okay. Whoops. And then we'll do this one midway. Not all the way. Midway. Okay. Oh, I love it. Okay. Now, what else should we... No. No more of this. Not right now. We'll revisit this another time. This seems like a lot of fun. I could spend hours doing this. Hours. Doing it. Um, I did want to do some of these. So let's see. What colors do we have here? Um, blue. We have blue. Didn't come out so great. A little light. And we have orange. <laughs> I'm making my own song. Okay. Orange. Better. And pink. pink <laughs> so orange and blue and pink and pink okay all right now we're now we need to make something pretty oh i like it in the pink okay let's move this off to the side here And cut these. I still don't know what I'm doing, you guys. We're just playing. We're just playing today. It's day 45. We're playing. Pink and orange. Okay. And move these out of the way. Okay, now what? I don't know. Let's see. We have this paper. That inspired me. That definitely inspired me. And then we have, um, I had prayer cards. Those inspired me too. Prayer cards with bunnies. Can we do that? Why not? Maybe I should cut these real quick. Should I? Yes. All right, let's just, I wasn't ready. <laughs> Time out. I wasn't ready. <clears throat> these and this and this okay I'm just gonna do this really quickly you guys so it'll be quicker if I cut them this way then fussy cut them out I just saw them and thought to myself let's use them <laughs> Otherwise, I would have done this prior. 
It's all right. So how are all of you? I hope you're all well. There's one. Prayer cards and bunnies. What do you know? Prayer cards and bunnies. They go together. It's Easter. It is Easter, you guys. It's Easter. Okay. It's beautiful outside today. Even though it's not... It's not... Um, so it is, uh, today's actually really, well, don't tell anybody, okay. <laughs> today's actually Tuesday yet. And, um, Tuesday. But it's really Friday for you. Friday, yes, today, today's Friday for you. I'm not at Friday yet. I hope the weather stays the same and it gets nice. Okay, there we go. And then here we got this one. This one we'll have to cut out, but this one we can do on here. I still don't even know what I'm doing yet to figure that out. I'm gonna have to. Time is ticking. <laughs> that one. All right, we only have a few more. Um, there. And there. And there. And here. Yeah, so if you guys are new to my channel and you're just coming here, uh, um, definitely go check out my other videos. Uh, this is the 100 day project. So, um, I am promoting it on my other, on my other social media sites as well. So, um, some of you are coming over from that and you're just seeing, you know, some of my posts, but I do have this, this has been going on for quite some time now. Um, I believe it started, um, about a month and a month and a half ago. <clears throat> and, um, yeah. The 100 Day Project is uh, something where you make art or you make your craft for 100 consecutive days, like nonstop. Um, at first, my theory was that I had to make 100 uh, really long project videos and just have to do, um, you know, a different craft every day. And I was starting to get stressed out about it. So... I actually had a list of 50 things to do for my craft. And then as I was doing um, my starting of the video, I thought, how cool would it be to restart at the beginning? Because there are so many new to my channel and so many new to this paper craft because it is taking off like a big storm. It's taking off. And, um, I thought, you know, let, let me share my, my views on things to start, to start you guys off in paper crafting. And I did that in my very first few videos. I shared with you, uh, what you could use around the house. If you didn't have, um, money or extra money, what you can do to make crafts, um, with the items in your house. Let me just come and around these corners. So yes, definitely go back and take a look. And then don't mind me, I'll do this all variously time, various times throughout the, <laughs> throughout the craft project. Sometimes my stuff gets stuck together. Okay, and I'm going to ink around some of these edges so I like that look. So I don't even know what I'm doing still. I'm just playing. I'm playing, you guys. I'm playing. This is what I do. I play with paper and fabric. I play. Nothing serious. Can't be serious because then you'll get you'll get stressed out. <laughs> we don't want that. I'm going over here to look at my stuff. I have stuff here from my digital kit. Um, I did pull out some stuff. I pulled this out. I don't know what I'm doing yet, though. I don't know if I want that. Do I want flowers? Um, I don't know what I want. 
I don't know. It's all very confusing to me. Oh, I like this. Because sometimes when you get too much stuff on your desk, you, um, you don't know what to do. I like that. Okay. How about these flowers? How about this? What about this? Bunnies? I'm wondering if we can do bunny. Can we do bunny? Maybe. <gasps> How cute. Oh, let me just cut that out real quick. <laughs> I don't, sometimes I don't know what I want, you guys. And, and you just have to bear with me because in the end, you all know, it comes out nice. No matter what I do to get there. <laughs> Oh, I had a question for you guys. So, somebody, I got an email from someone. Um, oh gosh, Deborah. I believe her name is Deborah. And she wanted me to teach a teach teach at a a scrapbooking fair in Texas. Um, a scrapbooking fair in Texas. Yes. Oh, I like that on there. Um. in August and I'm just wondering do any of you are any of you going to attend oh look how cute a, a a scrapbooking expo in August in Texas are any is anyone going there I don't know um I, I think I saw where it was mentioned that um um my my viewers would be going I don't know who would be going. I have to really think about it, though, hard, because I know I have to give an answer soon, and I want to. It's just, um, it's a cost. It's a cost for me that I wasn't planning on, you know, airfare and things like that. And, oh, what about, what if we did, like, a little booklet-type thing, but we did this this way, and then you opened it up. I wonder... Oh, we could put the bunny there. Oh, should we put the bunny on the outside? Hold on. <laughs> I don't know. How about we put the bunny there? Yeah, just like a little, a little, a little thing. <laughs> and what about little, oh, the little prayer cards. What, do we have more little ones? Here's the little one. Oh, look how cute. And we make a little pocket that goes in there. Let's do that. Oh, how cute. Oh, wait, where'd my image go? <laughs> there it is. Oops, this way. Okay, let's do that. I like that. That was cute. Okay, Um. so yes. Uh, there's a, so I guess there's a craft expo in, um, in Texas during the summertime. And I was asked to go and teach there. So I would I would love to do that. That would be that sounds so much fun. Um, but I just don't know. Like, are is anyone going to any kind of craft expo in Texas in August? I'm wondering. Do you uh, do you guys live in Texas? Does any one of my viewers live in Texas and know what I'm talking about? <laughs> if you can let me know. Um, I think that's good there. I need a scrape card. I'm gonna have to go and look on my email and see um see if i can find out more information about it look how cute and what about one of these little things can we put one of these maybe i'll cut it let me get my fabric scissors let me do that let me get my fabric scissors and i will make it a little bit smaller just a little bit And then there. Oh, I gotta concentrate, you guys. Okay. Oh, I love it. What about a piece of another uh, another piece of fabric? How about a little piece of ticking? No, because it takes over the bunny. But I like it there on the corner. Just like that. I like that. Let's just put that down. And then, oh, oh, 
I gotta put this in here. What do I wanna do? I think I just wanna, I think I just like it in there like that. Um, yeah, maybe we'll just glue it in there like a, like a little fabric whip. Just a tiny little piece of glue just to attach it like a little flip. Get a surprise piece of linen in there with some fabric on it. Cute. Okay, and then this we want to put on the front. So it's like a little booklet. A little cute little little booklet. Put that there. So oh, cute. And then how would we, hmm. I want those in there. Should we make like a little pocket? Um, hold on. <clears throat> hold on, I have an idea. Hold on, I'm going to get it from my printer. I had to print out more of my labels. I've been using them all. I'm wondering if we just stuck a little label as like a little corner tuck. Let's take a look. It might work. Let's try it. Okay. I'm concentrating, you guys. You know this already about me. Okay. I'm going to do the corner. Don't stick now. I wonder. Oh, maybe we'll just do that and tuck it in there. Yes. Okay. We'll do that. I'll be very, very careful just to get it right here. I'm going to put this down. Right along the edge. Let it dry a moment. Oh, <sighs> glue, glue. I put too much. I'm sorry. And then we'll put these in there. How cute. Hey. How cute. Okay, it needs to dry, so we're just going to put them this way for right now. I don't want to go all the way. And then, look. Oh, look how darling. <gasps> what happened here? Hmm. Or should we hang some? Oh, the bag is plain. <coughs> That's alright. It's fine. This way you can see the paper. Should we hang something from here? No. No. I like it like this. I like it like that. Okay, let's do, let's make another one. Let's do, let's do upper. Let's do this up like this. Oh, I like him like that. Look how cute. Okay, let's just glue him on. Oh, maybe we'll just glue just the top. So it's like a flip. Kind of like a fabric weave type flip. It's cute. Hmm. Okay. Cute. And then, what can we do in here? We'll put some more prayer cards. Why not? Oh, what if we just did them? Hmm. Oh, I have an idea. What if we just took my little labels and we just do a tiny little label? Like a little tiny label? Like a tiny little label? Let's try that. And we can use it. Hold on. I'll show you. Okay. Yeah. We'll just um we'll just do the same kind of thing. So 
the glue on along the bottom and then we'll just tuck it in there. <coughs> Excuse me, I need to take a sip. I've been talking too much. Okay, too much glue, too much. And we'll do the same thing over there. And just cut. Okay. And we'll just glue. And put this down here. Like that. But hey. All right, and put that in there like that, and in there like that. Oh, oh, maybe we could do one of these stamps on there. Um, look at this. Let's do this. Where's my, where's that brick thing? The, oh, okay. I need to make sure I put this on the right way. Okay, and then the vintage photos here. Should we do red? Maybe red. Where's my red? Oh. Am I gonna find it? I don't know. Hold on. I have a different red. Let me just see. Let's do this. We'll do it in red. I don't know how it's going to come out. Well, it's going to be really red, you guys. Really. Okay. <laughs> Let me do one more here. Perfect. Okay. In case anyone wants to know, this is Tulip Red by Versifying. Tulip. Look how pretty. Okay, so you guys got to stay, all right? Maybe it needs more. Maybe we need to put in more to stay. Stay in there. It needs more. It needs more. All right, there we go. Look how cute. And then, should we do him there? <clears throat> maybe I don't, maybe I don't want the flip. Maybe I'm just gonna attach it all the way. Oh, hold on one second. Okay, sorry about that. Okay. And let's see. Oh, and there's the timer. So, look how cute, you guys. All right, so wait, we need to put this on there, though. Let's put this on the back, up at the top, maybe. Let's just do that. Oh. Or maybe down at the bottom. Let's cut it. I need my fabric scissors. Don't you worry, I'm not going to waste any of this good linen. It's all going to go in something. <laughs> I don't know what. <clears throat> yeah, I think I'm just going to put that down there. At the bottom. I need to take a sip and say goodbye. Of my, I need to, um, of my talking, I'm talking. How cute. I love it. How darling. Look how cute. So just taking some book pages, you guys, and putting stuff in there. Oh, this is probably dry now, so we can put these down. Like that. Just like that. Maybe we'll, should we put a stamp on there? Let's do that. Let's put, let's put a stamp on there. And then I'll say goodbye. I'll see you guys tomorrow for day 46. It'll be Saturday for you. But for me, I'll be with my baby. I'll be with my little baby. Because I'm actually leaving today on the Friday. I'm leaving. I'm leaving. Let's see. There we go. And um, do we want it in the red? So we got pinks. We got pinks. Let's see what the red would look like if we stamped it on there. In the red. Now, we'll do it in the this one. Vintage. 
so good. I just gotta make sure, yeah, I have to make sure that it's right. <clears throat> you know, they're so small and my eyes are bad, so I wanted to make sure that I could see. Oh, beautiful. Okay, so thanks you guys for joining me for day 45. And I'll see you guys again tomorrow for day, oh, look how cute these are, day 40. Oh my gosh, look how darling. Day 40, um, day 46. Bye for now, my crafting buddies. I'll see you guys again soon.